No, of course, we are never satisfied losing. Uh, and I can say after last game, we were not only disappointed, we were ashamed of our performance. And uh, the only thing we can say is, is that we are sorry for this performance. Hopefully, we will not perform like this again, like, like we, we did in the second half against Alakli. Uh, and I don't want to take anything from Alakli. They, they played this game well. And we did not, so we, we had zero points, but also a bad performance, and this is not a good combination. And I understand the fans to be, to be frustrated. Uh, and uh, yeah, I, I, I admit this was not a good performance. Carabao is not our favorite uh, opponent. And especially at this moment, uh, we, we are having a bad spell. We have a lot of uh, absent players. We have had uh, almost no time for the new players to, to, to get to know our philosophy, our way of, of playing. And, and uh, yeah, it's also players that have not been playing for a long time, so they are not 100% match fit. But still, we need to play every three games, three days, every three days, every, every four, four days, we, we have to play. So now it's more or less only recovery session, so we, we can do very little tactic, we can do very little fitness in trainings, it's only t to, to prepare for the next game. So uh, thinking about the next opponent is Garafa, we have, uh, we have uh, had it really tough playing against Garafa, we have had good games, but we haven't, haven't uh, managed to win them now for some time. But inshallah, it, it always gets closer to the win, uh, and and I I, uh, I expect us to have a much better performance than against uh, Alakli, and uh, yeah, I think it's it's good that we get a game soon after a bad performance, so we can correct. And all the players, they are hungry to show that they are better than we did uh, last game. I, I don't think it's a decline. Yes, we, we did not win. Uh, we, we lost a game against Alcor on the 94th minute. Uh, uh, yeah, maybe a fluke, fluke goal. Uh, we, we could not uh, avoid this shot going in. So we lost two points in the first round. Then we lost against a better Alakli team than, than we were. I don't think it's a decline. We come from a run after the Corona, uh, come from a run of games where we did not win. Uh, only the, the Orido Cup game we won, so it's not like we've been winning in a long, long term, but now, now we are just uh, almost playing uh, continuous from our last, last season. So there was no break between season, it was not time to, to do something different, we just start to play continuously. Uh, I think now it's, it's, it's fatigue, we've been playing a lot of the same players. I can pick a lot of uh, reasons why we are not performing as well as before the Corona. Uh, we've lost a lot of players. Uh, we've always played now the last games without two foreign players. Uh, and injuries. Uh, and, and at the moment, I think we have two, three players out with the Corona. And, and uh, I think in total, we have had nine players out. So, so it's, a, it's a lot of things, but I always say is, is more or less, uh, when you start to talk about why, it's, it's more or less excuses. And I don't want to excuse anything. We, we have the players who are available, we play them. And, and we try to win our games. Uh, but uh, of course, we can pick some reasons, but in the end, it all sounds like excuses. The new players come with different qualities, for sure. All of them have had uh, a long time since they played. Mohammadi's last game in Portugal was in May. Now it's uh, September. Uh, the same for Yasser, Abu Bakr and, and uh, Aziz. They did not have much playing time in Al-Sat. So it will take time for them to get much fit, to get uh, the rhythm. And then they need time to, to get to know what we want. As, as a team, how we would like to play and so on. This is something that will come by time. So they give us more maturity, they give us uh, more experience, 
But at the moment, they are lacking much fitness. They are lacking a little bit fitness in general. And hopefully after the Garafa game, uh, we can use this month where there is no league game to work on these things. And, and after, the, after this Champions League break, we can go back to our best. Sebastian got injured in his last game for, for uh, Ryan. Uh, I think he had to go off on the 10th minute and uh, is recovering from this injury. At the moment, this is uh, doubtful for the Garafa game. Uh, and it's better now because we have a long break after the Garafa game, not to take risks and lose him out for this important period for him. So uh, we will take no risks, but hopefully he can, he can play against Garafa. Yeah, honestly, I don't think we have won a football match without Aaron. I'm not sure if we, 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 we won. At least we have been struggling a lot when he is absent. So he's a key player for the team. Uh, and this is from statistics only. Uh, he is a leader. He will make players around him better. So his impact for me is, is, is big. So losing him is always big. Uh, but like I said before, we, we, we have now played, I think, 10 games with always, always missing at least one and most often two of our foreign players. And we don't have the depth in the squad yet to, to cope with this. Th these are the guys who should carry, carry the, 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 the team and, uh, and lead. So by losing two of our foreign players every game is, is, is a big loss. Yeah, we gave a day off after the, the loss against al -Akli. and there was more psychology because everybody was uh, disappointed uh, and that was the only day I think for the last two weeks the, the players and the staff had off. Um, I think it was a good idea because when we came back we, we, after, after thinking about this it's, it's always better than do it when you are still angry talking about uh, games like like this one, so this is at least my my philosophy and based on my my characteristics, it's better to to wait until the next day when you watch the game again before you start to talk about the game. And then you can leave your emotions a little bit on the side and look at it more analytically. No, we know their strength and we know why they are strong. Uh, but I, I would say again, I think uh, both these matches, which we lost, I think, both 1-0, both these matches we played really well. The, these games against uh, Ryan, against uh, Alakli, were, were our best games of the, the season, even though we did not win. Uh, the last game after the Corona was a shame, big shame. Uh, and they, they won on, on referees' decisions, three referees' decisions, which were all wrong. But unfortunately for us, the, the VAR was uh, broken. So we, we, are, we are burning to meet them again. And we so much want to win. We so much want to win. And I think all the players will do everything they can to win Garafa tomorrow.